I'm Alex Livingston, Founder and Chief Innovation Officer at Jewelcase. And we're here today at an auto industry event demonstrating electric vehicles. But more importantly than that is how we're going to charge electric vehicles in the future. So we're working today with a very well-known OEM manufacturer that makes very high-end electric vehicles, demonstrating them to journalists and the jewel cases charging them on the back end. Typically, these events have been powered with gasoline generators, and jewel case now is providing large portable power that can go head-to-head -head on the pricing and the economics and the trustworthiness and beat out these diesel generators. Picture this generator as your grid. It's taking AC power and it's transmitting that all over the place. With Jewel Case, we're able to take our battery systems and move them so we don't need to pay for all of the cost of this infrastructure. Instead, we're just charging batteries to batteries. Our system here outputs 300 kilovolt amps at three phase 480 volts. Inside, we have nine inverters connected to nine different battery stacks, more than 550 kilowatt hours. Here we are out in the desert, away from the grid, providing clean, quiet charging for these electric vehicles. There is an increasing need for portable power and you know, the technology, the connectivity, the electrification of everything means that you're gonna need power in a lot more places than you did before. The way we produce electricity today we just don't have the on-demand power required to push a huge amount of energy into vehicles when either fleets or consumers are rolling up. With our years in the events industry, we've learned that being able to transport energy systems to a site is key to being able to electrify our fleets. The you know, Jewel case allows for EV charging and EVs to become more available to make it so this charging is much more capital efficient than it would be otherwise. Now that I have more than 15 years in clean tech and battery systems. There's no doubt in my mind that it's here to stay. The critical mass has been achieved. The support that, that uh, we're receiving from large corporations, from car companies, from governments, the clean energy mandates that we're receiving, this is the future and it's here. The future's here and right now. The potential is massive. 